What's going on guys? Devin with DCF Guns. We are here with Larry from Six Hour Academy. One of the great drills that I got to experience while I was here was how to find my holdover for beginners. Larry's gonna describe it for us and then we're gonna run it. Yeah, so basically what we're gonna do is we're gonna aim into this upper square area here. We're gonna use this one inch square as our aim point. I'll have Devin back off to about three yards or so. So uh, overall, a nice, a nice tight little group here you got going on. But notice the, if you, if you looked at the center of this group, which is approximately right in here, you're slightly below the square that you were aiming at. Do you know why that is? Not exactly. <laughs> All right, so with, with uh, shooting a red dot, what we have going on here is a mechanic, what we call a mechanical offset. We're gonna have the barrel or the bore of the uh, pistol down here. And somewhere up in this vicinity is our red dot. So if you, if you dig, you know, a quick little, uh, uh, caliper measurement here, all right, super accurate, but uh, I'd say a uh, half inch, maybe three quarters of an inch difference from where my red dot is to where the center line of my bore is. So if, I, if I'm aiming that red dot into that square, naturally I'm gonna end up shooting a little bit lower, all right? So we can correct for that by simply uh, aiming a little bit high. Take our red dot, use that caliper we got here, that three quarters of an inch, and we go from here up and maybe we put that red dot just on the upper edge of that square box and we'll shoot another five rounds and see if that makes any correction for you. Okay, good. Yeah. I see what you mean. Overall, a very, a very nice tight group here. A little bit of a flyer, but hey, at the end of the day, still not bad. But there's the majority of his group, four rounds right inside that, simply by elevating that dot Taking, in, taking into account that mechanical offset. Okay, good job, man. Thank you very much. Yeah, anytime, buddy.